This right here is a tiny sword. And this right here is the biggest sword in the world. Careful, it might be too heavy. So let's begin growing this tiny sword from step one. So this right here is a tiny wooden sword. And with this sword, we're gonna be growing it to the size of pretty much that mountain over there, where the first step of growing our sword is literally planting the sword. So without further ado, let me get some wood and get a hoe. All right, one wooden hoe. Let's prepare the land right there. And now with the tiny wooden sword, we can plant it. And it worked. And now we have a sword plant. Oh gosh, wait, I should probably get some water and stuff right by it. Okay, first, I'm gonna take all these crops. Let me grab all that. Thank you very much. And now with these crops, let's go ahead and get some bone meal. All right, there we go. Got myself some bone meal. By the way, I just learned that that worked in Minecraft. I didn't know that was a thing. And before we use the bone meal on the sword, we gotta get some water over there. All right, don't mind me. Gotta get one of this. There we go. And I don't think this guy will mind if I break his house. And now, what we need, pickaxe, shovel, axe, and no sword, I guess. Okay, here's the plan. I need to get water all around here, but I need a water bucket. Oh, gosh. Okay, real quick, let me get in the cave. All right, don't mind me. Just got to get a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Last one. There we go. One piece of coal and just one furnace. There we go. And we got a bucket. And now to make sure this thing lives. Okay, we got the water right there. Is this all I need? Maybe to play it safe, I have a little bit of an idea. Okay, so let me just go ahead and make a moat around. It. So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna do this here. Let me real quick surround you with all that you need. And there we go. Give him a little bit of space to grow, of course. And let me grab those torches. Look at the little guy. Let's go ahead and give him a name in the comments down below. We're th this is our baby right here. We're just trying to grow a good old little soil plant thing. And I think I'm doing this right. Well, I guess I could go ahead and try the bone meal then. All right, plenty of wooden sword. Grow. Oh, is it working? Oh, it grew a little bit. Yo, okay, now we can harvest it. Let me pick that up. And now we have a grown sword. Wait, what the heck does this do? Oh, wait, I can now cut these wood things that they're glowing. Oh, that's sick. All right, little sword can do some cool things. Anyways, it looks like we got to help around the village because there's a lot of exclamation points. So, uh, hello? What would you like, Mr. Lumberjack? Help him cut the wood. That makes sense. Okay, let me real quick cut all these then. All right, last ones. Let me chop this wood down. Thank you very much. I'm going to be keeping all this, I hope. All right, and that's going to be over a sack of wooden planks. Nice. All right, Mr. Lumberjack, we did the job. Oh, now deliver the planks to my customers? Oh, these guys. Wait, so I don't get to keep them. Oh, and I broke his house down earlier. Okay, we don't talk about that. You know what? Let's just go ahead and give him all the planks he needs. That's one happy customer. And the three over there. I mean, on the bright side, I didn't break this guy's house down. There you go, buddy. Take your time, planks. You get some planks. And you get some planks. Wait, do I have some stuff? Oh, okay. Here, take your planks real quick. There you go. We'll talk to the lumberjack soon, but don't mind me. Okay, okay. We're just gonna go ahead and borrow some of this. Okay, another happy customer. All right, did the job. Oh, he seems happy. I found this. It has no use for me. Oh, and he gave us a reinforced cobblestone. Maybe this is what we add to the sword. Okay, I'm gonna hold on to this just in case it actually makes the sword even bigger. And next up, let's talk to this guy right here because he has the big old exclamation point. Oh, what the? What? <laughs> okay. Anyways, Mr. Farmer, what's up? Separate the mobs and put them in their pens. Oh. <laughs> All right, Mr. Villager Horse, don't know how this happened, but let me cut you real quick. Oh, and that worked. All right, so I gotta get you in there and I gotta get you in there. Okay, don't go too far away, guys. Oh gosh, oh gosh. No, 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 stay inside. There we go. And where'd that villager go? No! Where is he going? All right, I'll come back for you. And now the pig cow. Let's real quick separate you guys and come with me. All right, Mr. Cow, I need you to come inside. We gotta get the pig, the cow, and the villager. Shouldn't be too bad, but you will go in here. Straight this way. Oh my gosh, I didn't see that at first. We have another one. Okay, all right, now it's your turn. Get in here, Mr. Pig. We are coming in. Mr. Pig, you're gonna go in here. That should be two of them. We gotta still get a lot of them back. All right, next up, that abomination. Oh, there it is. Okay, you know what? Let, let me just cut this guy. All right, separated. And now follow me, my friend. Straight this way. All right, get over here, chicken. We're almost in. Oh my goodness. So I gotta do this for all of you. By the way, guys, I don't think I'm supposed to bring the villager in here. So that, that guy's just kind of free. And senior sheep, come straight this way. So the last one I'm gonna have to get is the horse. And luckily enough, on the screen right now, we got a crap for a lead. So we're gonna just lead the guy inside with that special lead. Oh, since you were at the chicken, you get the chicken room too. All right, there you go. Have fun. Okay, final one. Now let's real quick make one crafting table. And what I need to get first is some some leather. Uh, maybe they have it in here. Oh, all right. I'm definitely gonna go ahead and borrow that. And now, let's go to make a lead. There we go. One lead. I don't really know where the horse went, though. Wait, is this the right horse? Um, they won't notice. Yeah. All right, come this way, my man. All right, don't mind me, guys. We are bringing, of course, the horse that you hired me to. All right, last one to get inside. Get right in here. 
Mr. Wartz. Mr. Wartz? Oh gosh, you know what? That's good enough. All right, I'm gonna keep the lead right there, just in case we need it for later. And now, that should be a job well done. All right, farmer, did we do it? Take this. Oh, and we got another reinforced cobblestone. Nice, all right. That's gonna be two of the jobs done, and I did see one more straight down here. There he is. All right, what would you like? Mr. Warrior. Warrior needs a sparring buddy. Oh, wait, are we fighting? Oh, we are fighting, all right. Go on, tiny sword. Do your thing. Sorry, brother. Oh, and we knocked him out. Oh, is he back up? You good? Oh, another round, I guess. All right, let's knock him out again. And do, do, do I just hit him while he's out? No, no, no. Okay, guess we're going three rounds. But it is the world's tiny sword, so maybe you can do a bigger fight than that. Oh, I think we should be good there. He seems happy. Call me strong. Oh, and from that, we get the reinforced cobblestone recipe. Oh, wait, so we're supposed to craft these. Okay, so right now we have two of these, and maybe we ought to make a lot of it. Well, we gotta get some iron, I guess. All right, watch the super fast mining. Okay, so now to make some reinforced cobblestone, all we gotta do is put the cobblestone together and then iron ingot, and then we get some reinforced cobblestone. So I guess let's make like a decent bit of it. Um, I guess 16 could be good. This wasn't changed though, so maybe it's special? No idea. Oh, wait, what? Place down my sword. Oh, wait, this thing? Can I place it down like right over here? Let me, I guess, try placing it here? Oh, wait, what's going on? Hello? Yo! Oh, okay. So we're apparently adding blocks to this thing. Oh, that's why we're reinforcing it. Right. Well, uh, that should be too bad. I, I guess we can just put like six on both sides and, you know, try to reinforce the tip. Okay. Let's go ahead and add this last block. And is it working? Oh, wait, something special is happening to it. And apparently with that process, we got a reinforced sword and it's bigger now. So now we got the bigger sword. Now with the sword, I got a girl with some oars. Wait, can I like break blocks with this? Oh, I am so sorry. I, I, I kind of stole your stuff already. You know what? I'm going to take that bread too. Okay, let me walk away real quick. There was actually a special ore area I found earlier. Oh, right over here, I think. This is the ore cavern. And so I guess we can test out mining with this thing like this. Okay, it's mining the ores, but it's not doing anything. Maybe I got to kill that guy first. Oh gosh. Hello, Mr. Slime? Are you nice? Okay, nope, not nice. All right, let's take him down. And oh wait, we got a slime covered sword now. I don't think it made the sword a little bit bigger, but we're getting there. And now, can we save the ores when we mine them? Wait, mine? Oh, it works. Yo, okay. That's gonna be a lot of ores mine, but I don't want to spend it all on gold and stuff. We did some iron earlier and oh, diamonds. Yes, diamonds are good. All right, let's mine that real quick. Oh, my enemy mines obsidian. What is this sword? Let's mine as many diamonds as obsidian as we can. There we go. And we only have a little bit more to go. A little bit more diamonds right there. And that should be a job done. Now add a hundred diamonds at once. Wait, what? I have a stack in two. All right, let's get some more diamonds in real quick. Let me grab all those. Grab those again. And I think we're very close to a hundred. Oh, there we go. Create a diamond golem. Path to a bigger sword. Oh, okay. I do think I have enough for a diamond golem, but we might need a pumpkin first. There we go. One pumpkin right there. And actually, we're going to need some shears in four diamond blocks. So, shouldn't be too hard. Let's get four down. And now, all we got to do is literally, I guess, far away from the village. Let's set this up right here where we got the golem set up. Get one pumpkin. And as soon as I shear this, I guess it will come to life. Hopefully, I don't have to fight it. All right. Here goes something. Oh, that is not a diamond iron golem. Okay. Come over here, buddy. Oh my gosh. We actually do really good damage with this thing. It's not even big yet. Let's get this guy down real quick. And down he goes just like that. And oh, wait. Did he just give me diamonds? Is that a little bit redundant? What is this? Oh, compressed diamonds. Now I got to smelt the ores. We got to make a very weird contraption where I got to drop everything into a whole thing. And then I guess we can use glass. Let's, let's grab a little bit of glass real quick. But we're pretty much making a big old vertical tunnel with some signs. Well, before anything, we gotta get lava. So, one second. Let me find some probably down here. Oh, lava. Okay, let me real quick grab you. There we go. And now, let's just get a lot of furnaces and cook the sand. Okay, now it's time. So, pretty much with the glass, let's, I guess, put that down there. We'll go ahead and make a seeing area, but the first thing we gotta do, I think, is I guess put the sign right there. Put some glass right here. Put some water. Then we gotta put another sign. It's for the smelting contraption thing. And now for the top, we put in lava. There we go. One lava and I think that should be it. Okay, before anything, let me make some ladders down here. No, my me. Six ladders should be good enough. Let's make it go all the way up. Perfect. And now, all we gotta do is throw the compressed diamonds down the lava thing. How many do I have in total? Oh, 100. This is the 100 diamonds for the sword then. All right, here goes something. Good luck, sword. All right, it's going down. And is the mechanism working? Oh, let me go down. Oh, and I think it's supposed to just stay in the water then. Okay, now will it catch the diamonds? I think I'm just supposed to throw it down then. All right, here goes nothing. Okay. I, th I think it's working. It's just going straight down. We gotta do 30 of them. All right, go on, diamonds. 
go in there. And now we just see what happens. Oh, it worked. Yes. And so now with that, we get a refined, way bigger sword. Oh, and we got a new craft. Before we use this thing, we now got to become a sword chef, apparently, to make it even bigger. What I think this does now, though, is I can hit things that are even farther away. Nice. Well, that's grabbed on the screen right now. I already have the bread. I need to get some sugarcane, an apple, and a cow. All right, one sugarcane. Thank you very much. Villager-wise, let's, I guess, just get one villager. That was easy, all right? Oh, we already have an apple. I just realized one apple. And now for the cow. So here's the problem. We're gonna have to do this a little stealthily because I, I kind of just did a job for them. I think I put the cow over here, didn't I? Um, let me double check. Okay, I think this might be it. All right, Mr. Cow, let me just real quick come over here. Yes, great cow ice. All right, now I just gotta borrow you. Sorry about that. Anyways, now we can go ahead and make the villager with one villager, one raw beef, bread, sugar, and then an apple. And then we get the chef villager. All right, I guess we could go ahead and place him maybe right here. All right, senor chef, welcome to the village. Oh, and he built a restaurant right away. Okay, all right, how's it going, man? Oh, get these ingredients? Wait, what ingredients? Oh, all right, we got an ingredients list. All right, right click this. Oh, those are all the things on the screen right now. We got the pig, the cow, the chicken, a piece of creeper, and grass and a potato. I have absolutely none of that stuff. Oh, wait, there's a creeper right there. Can I, like, cut this into pieces? All right, Mr. Creeper, let me try this out. Oh, wait, did it cut him into pieces? Oh, it did! We got creeper pieces! Now I got two creeper pieces, apparently, and I think I gotta get the chicken, too. Sorry about that. All right, let me get the chicken. Gotta get the cows. Sorry about that, too. Oh, my gosh. Uh, oh, yeah, that, 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 that's a little bit messy. But we got the cow pieces. All right, get a little bit more cow. There we go. And the sword is so big, it can cut things in half. So I got two of each thing, except the pig. All right, sorry about this, buddy. Let me grab the pig. There we go. Final recipe. Let's get some grass. And now let me steal some of those potatoes. Sorry, buddy. I'm gonna grab these real quick. All right, and now with everything done, let's go and give him two cow pieces. Oh, wait, I have to build a grill. He doesn't take it. I just gotta build something. How does one build a grill? Do I, like, legit just, like, build something? Okay, I mean, I can build a small grill. I think it more like an oven, but we, we, we can try a grill. Okay, so this is gonna be the top of the grill right there. Then we're gonna just put, like, a little thing here. It'll kind of look like a, uh, kinda like a chair. Oh, and I have a fun idea, actually. If we want to make the grill a proper grill, what we could do is what if we make some iron heavy pressure plates? And so each thing right here, like, we'll put one here, put one here, put one there. We'll even make a special one made out of wood, but we pretty much have a grill there. All right, let me press the confirmation button. Oh, that worked! Yo, okay, now we got fire. What am I supposed to do with this? I talk to the chef? Mr. Chef? Mr. Gordon Villager. Oh, make the meal. Oh, is that what the meal thing is there? Oh, what the heck? Okay, so it's a craft. So we got a bunch of bread, cooked meat, and then grass. Okay, let me real quick then. How do I make the cooked meat? Do I like throw the cow in or something? Oh, that works. Yo, does that work with the chicken? The chicken also gives it cooked mob apparently. Okay, so we need the grass as the lettuce. So let's real quick. Where did I put the lettuce? I have lost the lettuce. Oh no. Oh, good. Let's uh, get the grass right outside. Don't worry. It is real lettuce. Uh, it might just taste like dirt, but it's all good. All right, let's get the cooked meat. There we go. Why do they look like poop? Okay, anyways. Let's put the bread right there, and we get a burger, a hamburger. That, that's what the lore says. All right, Mr. Chef, here you go. Do you like that? Now the fries, apparently. Wait, how, how do I make fries? Maybe potato and fire? All right, fries coming up. Oh, and it worked. And it even got some plastic packaging straight from the fire. That, that That's a good grill, you know. All right, here you go, Chef, some French fries. And it says perfect, nice. And from that, we get the kitchen knife upgrade. Wait, what? Oh, guys, our sword just got a lot bigger. And it's on fire now. Yo. Wait, at the top, it says cut the sea. Wait, like the, the sea right here? Hold on. All right. If it's this long that I can cut the ocean, I guess let's try it. All right. Swing. Oh, kind of worked. Oh, wait. Is it stuck down there now? Hold on. I need, I need to get my sword back. Hold up. Villagers. Why are there buff villagers behind me now? <laughs> Right. Okay. Can, can I just uh, ask you to help me? Right click. Oh, wait. Is he on his way already? Oh, my gosh. But he's quick. All right, gentlemen. You go over there. And you go straight that way. Thank you. All right. Last one. There you go. Oh, and they're all there. Yo, it's the boys. All right, Mr. Buff Villagers. Um, We got to pick up that thing. How, how are we doing this? Oh, wait. New craft unlocked a floaty. Oh, so now we got to make some floaties. All right. So we need some feathers to make them. And I know just the spot. Oh, gosh. They're going to hate me. Oh, wait. I hear a lot of chickens. Hold on. Before we go inside, I'm gonna have to make not the best sword, but a normal, regular diamond sword. But real quick, I think I can just walk in, right? Oh, wait, wait. Nope, nope, nope. We're gonna do this the old-fashioned way. Let's real quick just poke a hole right here. And now to get some chickens. Sorry, guys. All right, give me one sec. I'm just gonna get enough feathers. Okay. 
Many chickens later. Let's go ahead and make some floaties. And what the heck is this thing? All right, four floaties. And now my job is to go down there and put these in. All right, wish me luck, guys. Let me eat some bread. Don't eat before you swim. And here we go. Oh, gosh. Okay, down we go. I just got to put them in the spots. Spot number one. Spot number two. Three. Oh, gosh, I'm going to drown soon. And four. Oh, gosh. Okay, should be good. Okay, we got the floaty set up. This is a rope, apparently, to pull this out. And so without further ado, guys, I'm hoping you guys can get it out. But here we go. Pull. Am I supposed to pull, too? Oh, oh, no. Okay, that wasn't heavy enough. Okay, it said try horses now. All right, let's get some horses now. Okay, first horse right here. Mr. Horse, go straight over there. I think he's on his way. Next horse right there. All right, Mr. Horse, go over there. And last horse. Let's get you over there, buddy. All right, go on. Oh, wait, it's working. They're making their way. All right, horses, this is the plan. We pull back. Do I just, like, right-click you guys? Right, oh, 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 they're going, they're going. Pull! Oh, yes! Oh! Oh, my gosh. Good job, guys. How do I pick this up now? Do I just, like, grab you? Oh, it's stuck in there. Try using a tool. And you know what would work probably then? If it's obsidian, let's try down pickaxe. I just realized, because if fire went into water, we get obsidian and then down pickaxe. Oh, that worked. Yo, oh my gosh, this thing is getting long. Okay, there's a competition being held in the village. Join it. Oh, maybe it's that over there. All right, looks like some villagers are already going over there. Oh, okay, this is it. And Mr. Ventos, can I go in? You need a fencing sword to enter the competition. Oh, is this not a fencing sword? Oh, it's not a fencing sword. Wait, how do I make my blade thinner? Wait, could I technically place this down again? Let me go here real quick. Place this down. Oh, gosh. Okay, it's working again. Oh, and that is quite the sword. Could I just make it thinner by breaking all this? All right, this is gonna take a bit. Give me a sec, guys. And it's done. That is definitely a skinny sword. And I guess it's the confirm button. Her? Oh, and that worked. And now we get an obsidian fencing sword. Wait, cut different types of blocks? Wait, am I supposed to make it sharp or something? Okay, what type of things do I cut? Can I cut dirt? Cut. Oh, that works. We got cut in half dirt. What about cobblestone? Does that work? Yo, cut in half cobblestone. Can we do hard stuff like obsidian? Oh, and we can even cut obsidian. Now for the real test. I have an idea, guys. Let me go all the way down. Don't mind me. Let's maybe try bedrock. Oh, okay. Nice. All right. Let's go as deep as we can go. Oh, and there it is, guys. Okay. Finally got some bedrock. And now all we got to do is cut it, I think. All right. Cut. Oh, my sword is now sharper than a kitchen knife. We cut bedrock. Yo! So now we have a cut in half bedrock. Don't know what I'm supposed to do with this, but we got a sharp knife. All right, with this, I think we should be able to go into the competition now. All right, Mr. Competition Host, is this good enough? Oh, you may join. You will face three opponents. Enter the ring. All right, do I just go here? Oh, there he is. X Storio versus Noob. All right, good luck, Noob. Here we go. Oh, no, this poor guy. I'm so sorry. Oh, one. Nice. All right, let me get back to my spot. X Storio versus Grievous. Wait, what the heck? Villager Grievous? <laughs> Why does he move like that? All right. Well, let's take this guy down. Gotta do the strafes. And that's gonna be another one. All right. That's two down. One more to go. Wait, what? A rock? Do I, like, smack it? Um, hello? Versus ninja. Huh? Okay. Oh, wait. Are we snapping it? Oh, we're trying to do more damage. Oh, and I got it. We have our winner. Come to me to claim your prize. All right. Mr. Uh, Ventos, let me go down. And that was a weird competition. All right. Where's our prize? Oh, and he gave it a diamond blade. Do I, like, add this to the sword then? We right click that. And oh, my. This is a Trojan giant sword. Turn my sword into Trojan horse, it says. Wait, how do you do that? I mean, we can place it down here, right? Oh, what the heck? Okay, it has a bottle on it. And now we got to craft some wheels. On the screen right now, got some wheels. Luckily, we already have iron pretty much from mining in that other place. So let me go ahead and make some good old wheels. I got to get, I guess, four of them. All right, one, two, three, four. Oh, and now I got to recruit villagers. All right, let me get you guys in. All right, that's going to be five of you already. And maybe these guys over here too would be good. Join the team, guys. That should be eight. Nine. Actually, number 10 right there go straight over there and i'm gonna guess maybe they'll shrink down to the bottle oh wait some are already tiny in there yo look at them all right some more villagers you go you go all of you add to the thing all right and now we just need one more uh do you want to help nope you're stuck down there oh what about this guy all right last guy done and that's all of them oh wait now i gotta arm the villagers oh sticks or iron wait i can give them sticks or iron i mean sex is easier right all right gonna be a trojan horse and we're gonna go into battle let's go ahead and just give you all sticks oh they're going tiny all right get in there guys hold on take all the sticks you need boom boom three more to go there you go and that should be all of them all right everyone let's go this way i think i'm supposed to shrink down with you guys but i'm gonna act like i'm just delivering you guys i'm just, all i am is extorio oh and here it is all right just delivering a big old minecraft sword let me just place it right here do i just talk to one of you guys a gift i'm sure the town will love it come in oh and they're taking it yes okay let's drive it inside oh no they caught on no go on villagers fight 
Everyone fights. Oh my gosh. Look at that got giant swords. Can I get my sword? Let me get my giant sword over here. Hold on. Oh my gosh. All the villagers pretty much lost. Oh no. Let me push the wheels. Come on. Get those wheels off. Let me get my Trojan sword out. And let's battle. Oh my gosh. Holy. I just destroyed them in one hit. Put out the villagers. Oh, okay. Of course it's a ravager. Hold up. I have three checks. Literally. The sword is so long. Down it goes just like that. And from that, we get a ravager horn. Oh wait. Are we adding this to the sword? All right. Let's see what happens with this. Oh my gosh. Did it just make it curvy? Oh, this is cursed. This is very cursed. Well, I'd say that's a job well done, even though we lost everyone. What well, now? Oh, wait, what's going on? Oh, it's a going? Hey, yo! Okay, what the heck? Is the sun, like, out of my sword or something? Right. Now we can't be on the outside. New plan, then? We got some new crabs on the screen right now, which it looks like water. Maybe we can cut water then now? All right, I am gonna literally peek as little as I can and try to go farther and farther. Or, wait, technically, could I use water to get all the way over there? Curvy giant sword. Can I get water from this? Splice! Oh! Wait, that works! Yes! Give me the water blocks! All right, let me get as much as I can. I don't think I'll get set on fire if I jump into the water. Into the water! Ooh. Okay, feels good to be down here. So, just so we don't burn a little bit more, let me set up a home base right here. And now, all we gotta do is make some water armor. All right, shouldn't be too bad. I think it's literally this, this. Then we make the boots and the helmet. Now we can actually put it on. Oh, that feels better. Get closer to the sun and then cut it in half? Oh, make a catapult. Oh, maybe not stack up then. Wait, how am I supposed to make a catapult? It's not a crap for it. Do I just, like, build something? I got a catapult button given to me. Maybe I'm supposed to, like, stand, like, in a catapult-type thing. Thing. We're gonna call this a catapult right here, and I'm gonna be put right here, and maybe it'll launch me. I don't know. Let's try it, I guess. Pressing the button. Oh, I think I'm supposed to just summon a pocket catapult. Well, that works too. Oh, I kind of I clicked it really quick. Okay. Oh, what the heck? Oh, we're in the sun now. Let me real quick take care of you guys. Sorry. Love me some rechecks. There we go. And I think we just gotta cut this thing in half. Okay, Mr. Sun, here I go. Let's do this. Oh, guys, did my sword just become a sun sword? Yo. We now have a sun sword and the sun is at the tip of it. With the power of the literal sun, it sets. All right. Well, I think that's pretty much a job well done, guys. Without further ado, let's head back down. All right. Here we go. Holy, this thing is big. But now we got to make a sword kebab. Could we just hit something and add it to the kebab? Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's real quick. Do I just add you? Oh, and it added the pig to the thing. Now it impales sheep, apparently. Oh, I guess I could just borrow this sheep right here. All right, sheep. Let's grab him. And now we got a sheep. And now it says villager. The this guy will do. All right, come over here. Sorry, brother. Oh, and now we got the villager on there. Holy, this thing is getting big. Now impel a zombie. All right, uh, maybe down the cave. Oh, zombie right there. All right, let's get you on. And now we got the zombie. Next up, spider. Okay, now the spider. Let's add you there. And oh, okay, this thing's getting long. All right, now a creeper, which hopefully we can find one soon. Oh, okay, that's creeper done. And oh my gosh, the sword literally sticking out the cave. And now impel a village house, huh? Like just any village house? Wait, what? Why does this house look a little bit weird? This might be the one we gotta impale. All right. Oh! Oh my gosh. What is this shish kebab right now? And now we gotta impale a full on desert temple, apparently. Where would that be? I think there was a desert around here. Okay, so Coliseum. And then across the river, the most weird looking desert temple ever. Okay, here goes something. Impale! Did we get it? Oh my gosh, we got it. Now find a way to the end. Um, okay, wait, how am I supposed to use the shish kebab to get to the end? Oh, wait, I think we may have found it. Slab from the end. Am I supposed to cut this or something to get to the end? Uh, slice? Oh, wait, we sliced it in half. Is that it? Did I slice it again? Oh, we sliced it into fours. Do I just keep slicing it? Oh my gosh, okay, now it's like 16 of them. What the heck? How many times can I slice something? This might be regretful. Oh my gosh. Okay, might be doing too much slicing now. Oh my. Can I do it one more? time guys I, I i don't know if we can go farther than one pixel it is one pixel right now we've gone farther than one pixel it's a line now can i cut it even thinner oh no wait black holes for me huh oh is this taking me to the end Oh, wait, that worked. And oh my gosh, my sword is giant. Guys, the sword literally pierces through my hotbar, but now it's time to fight the final ender dragon and kebab it. All right, Mr. Sun Dragon, come straight over here. Let me real quick kebab you and we'll call it a day. Okay, so I just needed to perch and actually, could I literally hit it from up here? All right, come on, buddy. Let's get you all the way down. And without further ado, let me see how I can kebab this guy. Oh, it worked. Yo! And down goes the dragon with that final hit. And oh my gosh. What the heck is this sword? Congratulations, challenge complete. Anyways, hope you guys all enjoyed. Have a great one. And here's a video just like this one. Bye, guys.